look at this problem. Looks like very little information is provided. Plus 10 minus 10 volt and there is a PNP transistor. So the emitter current is flowing through and there is a base current flowing out that is passing through 100 kilo ohms. Collector current is passing through 5k. The question here is calculate all the currents that is base current, collector current, emitter current and also find the value of beta and alpha. The only information we have is 1 volt at the base. If you have 1 volt at the base there must be a current through 100k. We can work out that current. That current must be same as base current IB. Therefore, base current is voltage at the base divided by 100K. That is 1 over 100K 10 microampere. So that current is 10 microampere. If you know the base current, which is 10 microampere, how do you find the collector current? We are looking for beta IB, but beta is not given. What is other choice? Voltage at this point is 1. This is PN. P needs to be a higher potential for this BJT to conduct. So voltage at the emitter is voltage at the base plus 0 0.7 volt. Now we go found voltage at the emitter which is 1.7 volt. Now remaining calculation becomes simple enough. Why? Because now we can work out that current which is supposed to be the emitter current. Emitter current is 10 minus 1.7 divided by 5k. We get 1.66 milliampere. So we found the emitter current, we found the base current. It is easy to find collector current now. Collector current is IE minus IB. That is 1.66 milliampere minus 10 micro that is 1.65 milliampere. So we got all the three currents that we are looking for. We found voltage at the base, one volt given. Voltage at the emitter, we found it. This voltage is called voltage at the collector. How do you find voltage at the collector? Negative supply voltage plus collector current multiplied by 5k. That is negative 10 plus collector current is 1.65 milliampere multiplied by 5k. We get negative 1.75 volt. Now just a question. Is the base collector junction in reverse bias? There is a way to find out. Work out VCB. That is voltage at the collector. That is minus 1.75 minus voltage at the base which is 1. 
we get minus 2.75 volt VCB is less than zero definitely it is in reverse bias now question how do you find alpha and beta alpha is IC over IE 1.65 over 1.66 the answer is 0 0.994 next how do you find beta IC over IB 1.65 milliampere divided by 10 micro answer is 165 see we only had one voltage given we worked out three different currents and two different voltages